Namaste, my kings and queens. Thank you so much for gracing my channel. Your presence is such a present. So it's only right that I reciprocate you with the gift of guided messages. I'm wishing you all peace, healing, and prosperity. Please make sure you like, share, and subscribe, please. This is a daily collective reading. Okay, this is going to be a general reading around the collective. Okay. Some energy may come up about you, your partner, and your situation. Alrighty, so I'm going to first hop in with the tarot. Alrighty, and see what's going on. Alrighty, oh, some of you are out having a good time. We have the three of cups at the bottom of the deck. Today is the last day of Libra season. Alrighty, so... Happy belated birthday, Libras, and happy birthday, Scorpio. Okay. Scorpio, I will be doing your reading next, alrighty, for your birthday reading and for the November content, alrighty. Alright, let's see. provide me with messages for the collective whoa my spirit is jumping ahead here <clears throat> I see the high priestess came out all right my Pisces babies or my intuitive beings okay all right let's see messages for the collective please What's going on with the collective today? October 21st. Alrighty, we have the Two of Pentacles. Alrighty. I don't know why that's giving me um, that um, Scorpio Libra cusp. Alright. So some of you may be cuspers watching, but also some of you may be juggling. Um, Alright, we have the Nine of Pentacles here. Alrighty, we have the Wheel of Fortune. And we have the Five of Cups. And then I have one that fell. Alrighty, that was the, the Nine of Wands in reverse, but we're going to go ahead and put that back. So for some of you, I'm getting maybe you're juggling between your, your single lifestyle but you're suffering a loss, okay, or a cycle may have ended in a relationship or situation, okay? But as a nine of pentacles, you guys are coming up very independent, very successful. You guys have been putting in the work in regards to your home life, your self-care, alrighty? A lot of you have really been taking care of yourself. I'm getting here, a lot of you may be um, really uh, upping your wardrobe here okay with the nine of pentacles alrighty but I did get an energy of some of you um do sh uh, shop therapy or you go shopping as a form of your therapy when you're feeling down okay when you're feeling down when you're feeling out you go shopping, some of you guys online shop a lot, okay, retail therapy, there you go, I got retail therapy with that, alrighty, let's see, give me two more cards please, for the collective please, alrighty, we have Oh, we have the Ace of Cups, alrighty. So, with the Ace of Cups to the Nine of Pentacles, you guys are getting a love offer coming in here, alrighty. Um, the, this person or this situation is something you weren't expecting here, okay? With the Two of uh, Pentacles and the Five of Cups, okay? Some of you were going through 
um, a grief or a loss, okay? But then here comes this offer of love here, alrighty? So now you're kind of juggling in between the two, like, if I, am I ready? Um, am I ready or not? Ready or not, here I come, you can't hide. I'm gonna find you and make you want me. Alrighty, this person is coming in, ready or not, alright? Give me one more, please. Give me one more, please. One more card for the collective. Whoa, that's too many. Okay, yeah, we have the Six of Swords here. So yeah, definitely I'm getting with the collective, maybe some of you had to walk away, okay, from this connection, alrighty. Some of you maybe even had to move away or you're moving, okay, you're preparing for a move here, alrighty, that could be for some of you. Alrighty, I'm getting here um, a sense of you packing your bags, you and your children, okay? You're not moving alone, okay? So that may be why you're sad, okay? You may be in a situation where you really have to leave a situation or a person that you really, really love, okay? But let's see here. I'm going to pull some romance angels on this. Let's see. Give me some additional messages around this energy, please. Additional messages, additional messages, please, around this energy. For the collective for today, October 22nd. I'm sorry, ooh, October 21st. <laughs> Okay, so tomorrow may be significant for some of you. Maybe some of you have a birthday tomorrow, October 22nd. Okay, so we have playfulness. All right, I'm going to put these here. We have playfulness. We have let your friends help. All righty. And we have release your ex. Wow, okay. All righty. So with this energy, I'm getting here that some of you, like I said, you are in a loving, um, playful relationship, okay? This situation or this um, love connection that you were in, already, it allowed you to let your inner youthful spirit shine, okay? You had a lot of fun in this connection. You had a lot of um, playful and flirty moments here already but something did cause grief something did cause some um, a feeling of loss a feeling of desperation a feeling of um, something not ever being the same something not ever coming back together we will clarify that five of cups here because yeah that's throwing this energy off okay but that is causing for some of you to have to move away okay some of you may be moving with friends it says here let your friends help okay ask for and accept support from others alrighty so some of you may be having a hard time accepting help from people okay especially with the nine of pentacles here you guys are very independent you guys are used to making sure everything is taken care of everything is done okay um the home front your foundation everything is set okay but with this five of cups and the let your friends help you're in a situation you're in a sticky situation and it could be in regards to um love okay it could be in regards to a relationship i also got here some of you got into a relationship against your better judgment and just like you thought it didn't turn out the way you thought it would okay maybe some of you went back to an ex okay release your ex this time has come the time has come to clear your energy 
So maybe a lot of you are getting away so that you can clear your energy. Alrighty. Let me see in here. I'm going to clarify this five of cups. I want to know what this says here. What is the five of cups here? We have the three of uh, swords at the bottom of the deck. Could be a third party situation already. Maybe your love interest or the person you were madly in love with, they went back to an ex already. Or they went back to a situation that you thought they would never go back to. Maybe this person had to complete a cycle with someone and they, and they had to um, walk away or move away. But let's see, what's the Five of Cups here? What's the Five of Cups, please? For today, October 21st, 2020. Wow, the Ace of Cups again. So some of you are definitely grieving a loss of a relationship, okay? Really, really um, grieving the loss of someone you had a, a real connection with, okay? Um, you did not want to, you did not want the situation to end, I'm getting here. You're very sad. I'm getting here, you guys are having a hard time moving away, Okay. I'm getting the energy of, you know, some of you are packing your bags, your suitcases, your boxes, and you're, you're crying, you're bawling at this time, okay? I'm, I'm getting um, nonstop tears, like waterfalls, okay? But I feel like this is just in the moment, okay? Um, also with the Wheel of Fortune here, I feel like the universe is calling for this to happen, Okay? And then I also feel that this connection will come back together. But right now, at this time, it's time to clear your energy of this, okay? I just got the energy of rejection is God's protection. Alrighty. I apologize for any outside noise. I have my window open this morning. And normally I don't, but... Let's go ahead and clarify the playful. What's this playful? This playfulness. What's this playfulness? Recapture romance. Allow your inner youthful spirit to allow your inner inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. What's this playfulness here? Thank you. Wow, wedding rings, union, wedding, married, soul connection, eternal love, everlasting promise. Yes, some of you, you were engaged with this person or you guys were um, planning to get married soon, okay? Or you guys were planning a date, okay? This was in the works here. And then something happened. Something led to a separation. Okay, give me one moment. Okay. Sorry about that, Collective. I had to close my window there um, during trash day or whatever, I guess. But um, yeah, so with wedding rings and playfulness, some of you were on your way down the aisle with this person. Alrighty. What's the let your friends help you? Okay, ask for and accept support. What is this? Alrighty, so yeah, at this time, you guys are really needing support. You're needing um, that moral support, that shoulder to lean on. Okay, like I said, a lot of you are um, really crying and bawling your eyes out. You're really sad at this time, okay? But with the, the, with the Ace of Cups here twice, I feel like this connection will reunite. Alrighty, what's the let your friends help? What's the let your friends help? Thank you. Okay, we have boat. 
receiving what you need, progressing, arriving, moving on, closure issues, okay? So for a lot of you, this situation just ended like that, alrighty? This person may have came in and abruptly told you like, hey, this isn't going to work. I don't think I want to do this anymore, alrighty? Healing heart, healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationships or addictions. Wow, okay? So this separation is causing um, you to heal your heart, okay, from this toxic relationship that you were in or toxic addiction, but I'm really getting relationship here, okay? Some of you are having issues with closure, okay? You're still wanting to know, to know why. You're in a state of disbelief. You're in a state of confusion. You don't understand why this happened, okay? What's the release your ex here? What's release your ex? What's release your ex here? And for some of you, you're the ex this person is releasing, okay? So this could be, you know, vice versa. The energy could definitely be um, interchangeable here. What if we release your ex? Thank you. We have soulmates. Wow. Soul connection, partnership, agreement, soul contract, date, meeting someone new, dating, get back out there, plan, set a date. Wow. Okay. So I feel like this is this is okay let me see so i see this two different ways you guys are definitely soulmates okay you and this ex you're needing to release but i'm getting the energy that you you are this person or however the energy resonates are all you know okay and i feel like this person is needing to separate from you because they need to see what's out there or this could be you okay they need to know and be sure that you are who they want to spend the rest of their life with okay this person or you or you're needing to date you need to meet new people you're needing to get out there okay you're i i have i'm getting a feeling as well you or this person feels like you have more than one soulmate, okay? Or there's a soul contract that needs to be complete here. Like I said with this uh, will of fortune here. Okay. What's the will of fortune here? Are better yet? Why is this person separating from the collective? Why is this separation taking place? King of Swords. We have the Death card. And we have the Four of Pentacles here. So some of you could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra, okay? Or you're dealing with a Scorpio. I'm feeling like this um, this connection may be ending at this time, okay? Um, I feel like maybe one of you were smothering the other, okay, really wasn't giving the other person uh, the opportunity to breathe or transform into the person that they want to be. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, because we have the nine of pentacles here with the death card. Alrighty, this person, um, loves to transform and morph into something else. Okay. And with the eight or the four of pentacles, you or the other person does not allow that to happen within this connection. So they're needing to separate themselves. OK, as the king of swords, they're very, very smart, articulate. They're mentally stable. OK, and they're they're really good at um, voicing how they feel. Alrighty, and I feel like this was stated to you. This was asked of you. Okay, this person loves you dearly. They love you so much, but at this time, they love themselves more. 
and they have to do what makes them happy okay so i feel like this person um is either going to go out go get out there and date okay and see if they can really find someone else who understands where they're coming from okay they're going to release you at this time but with you guys being soulmates if they don't find what they feel like they need they will be back all righty so just keep that in mind already keep your keep a lookout i want you guys to know who are in this grieving energy and feeling really down and out reach out to your friends okay reach out to your soul support your soul tribe they are there to help you reach out to your spirit guides okay you're going to be fine okay this too shall pass i just got for you all right collective so i hope this helps i hope this resonated Alrighty, please make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you all in my next video. Ashe.